We're back. And I can finally say we're back because... You don't miss me anymore. I missed you. That's why you're back. I know. It has been so damn long since I've stared at Amnesia. I don't remember what the fuck you were doing. <laughs> yeah, I know. You didn't bother to look either, did you? I, I'm sitting here looking at a wall with two torches and a barrel in the corner. Where does that tell me that we are? What torches? I, I can't remember. Well, there's glowy lights. They're... Well, you could have looked at the past episodes. Oh. Oh. I think I... No. 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 No, you don't do that. No. No. Of course not. Do you do that? Yes. I didn't do it this I think time. I you're a liar. I didn't do it this time, but I do look in the past episodes. Especially when people point stuff out to me. Am I crouched? I'm crouched. Oh, there we go. Oh. Kitchen. Kitchen. All the way up that dank, dark hallway. That is a very dark hallway. It is a very dark hallway. What button is it for my lantern? Wait, before I do that. I think I'm okay. Oh, that's the button. <sighs> Wait. What? I think I'm remembering something. You were in a narrow corridor, in a low corridor, and we had agreed on the left. Didn't we? I'm assuming that that's what that is. Yeah, and we come out of that. We were in a uh, prison cell. We dug through the floor. We came through the, the tunnel. Wait, and we agreed on left, didn't we? If it's left, then why is this w uh, winding right? That implies that we went right. I think we went left and then came to a dead end and to a right. Actually, okay. How did the hell does that help me? Why are we here? I don't know. It, it is. Yeah, it's just we have to explore at this point, I'm guessing. I don't want to explore. I remember what's here. I don't want to. You don't know what's here. Yes, I do. through this area yet. Crystal clear. Awesome. Actually, I'm, I'm pretty okay for supplies, all things considered. Oh. There we go. Why do I still have this? I don't know. There must be a use for it later on. Be surprised. This isn't like an old school RPG where you get an item, you hold on to it for three quarters of the game and find out you never had a use for it in the first place. Sure this is. Could totally waste um I'm going to leave like a little thing there just in case. You're leaving yourself a lantern just in case you or a torch just in case you screw up. Well, I'd like to have a light source while I'm going up here so I can go back. Oh, a door. Goes into... Come on, I'm standing in light. Let me... Okay, there we go. This is the kitchen, is it not? Hello? No. Oh, come on. With how many people have already seen in here, you seriously, I think, walking in and saying hello is a good idea? Hey, I am not giving up on the concept that there may be friendly people. We are still in a prison, after all. Before and we did hear some nice people screaming earlier. Don't remind me. We've been hearing them the whole time, and I've just been ignoring it. I'm kind of resigned to You've been to ignoring the, the poor people screaming for help? We for haven't found anybody! Time. Oh, note. Notes are friendly. 2nd of August, 1839. I have arrived at the village of Altstadt. It's a haven in the midst of a vast forest and the last stop before my final destination, Castle Brennenburg. It's late in the evening and the outrider, who has been with the coach since Bremen, advised me to wait until morning before I venture further. Hmm. I've arranged for a bed at Der Mühle, the village's only inn, and am now waiting for the sun to rise. I try to sleep, but as I close my eyes, I see the men who fell victim in London. My fear and shame forces me to witness the same scenes over and over. They are dead because of me. You don't know that. kind of remember we touched base on that. <laughs> You're making a novel out of assumptions there, Daniel. <sighs> 
Especially a guy who can't remember what's going on. Actually, those, that note was probably written before he lost memories, so he probably did remember what was going on then. True, I suppose. You know, this doesn't lead any credence to that we might find some people with all the foods rotten in the kitchen. Well, that would be why people are screaming. They're hungry. They just need some food. Oh, God, even the bread. Have you ever tried that what Wonder are you Bread talking stuff? About? That, that looks like it's bread that has green cheese break, uh, baked into it. No, blue cheese. Blue cheese baked into it. There is such a thing as green cheese. Ooh, lantern oil. I'm gonna make toast. What? Can you think of a better way? Um, not using your bare hands to hold a loaf of bread over an open flame. Well, I don't have another way of holding... Also, what hands? Where do you see hands? Okay, so you're using your telekinesis to hold that loaf of bread? Oh, fucking apparently, because it doesn't burn at all. And we know fire is hot. Remember? Way back when we touched the candle? Yeah. Fire is indeed hot. But this does not burn. We can only surmise that I have telekinetic powers. That's actually quite useful. I wonder why you didn't remember that you had telekinetic powers when you started the game. Gee, maybe it's because I had fucking amnesia! Where would you get that idea? Although it's a hand symbol. That does imply I'm using my hands, but fire is hot. Except it... it Damn it! I touched the fire. <laughs> okay, so if I touch fire with kinetic powers, that hurts. But when I use telekinetic powers to hold stuff over... Fire? It doesn't hurt? Makes sense to me. Sure it does. Oh, I am not lighting that. I'm not falling for that shit. Okay, so broken plates, rotten apples, rotten bread. Rotten... Whatever the fuck those are. You know, if there's some cheese around here, I bet you it'd still be good. Not necessarily. Cheese actually gets mold pretty quickly. On the other hand, if you caught up the outer layer of the cheese, you'd be fine. Well then. All I need to find is a unbroken cheese wheel. Oh, that stuff's definitely rotten. Poor dog. Do you remember the dog? Yes, I remember the dog. Ah, oh, well, such is experimentation. Oh. Hey, this stuff's all Latin. Am I plugging that in? Uh, delirium... What? Uh, Tremin... Treminent? Yeah, Treminent. Um... Butri? And... Applicandus. I'm pretty sure that's Applicant or Applied or something like that. Or have it auto-detect. Thanks, Google. Okay, I probably misspelled, misspelled some of this. Probably. Have a have a good look. Um. Let's see. I can't. I don't think I can bring it close. Oh. Oh. Ah. Oh. Sorry. 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 Hang on. Hang on. There we go. There we go. There we go. I don't think I can get any closer than that. And that might be an S in Tremens. S M S E M. Yeah, Tremens or something. Three. And. Candus, I think. Yeah. That looks like it's a B. A B. That oh. looks like a Bravo. Epicambus. Oh, yeah, sure. Okay, um... Uh, delirium tremens is a state of confusion of rapid onset that is caused by withdrawal from alcohol. And the other stuff, oh, you, got, you got nothing? Uh, not yet. Let's see. So... Delirium brought on by 
of alcohol withdrawal? You can bottle that? Possibly. Possibly. Uh, let's see. I mean, the bottle's empty. So. The pouch is empty. Are you sure the bottle is empty? Pretty sure the bottle's let's empty. See. I think we'd hear something delirium, slashing It's there. basically a type of delirium caused by alcohol addiction, and that's apparently a G. Guturi. Guturi? No, that could be a G. I don't think it's a G. Yeah, Guturi? Applicandus? Um, it's apparently uh, a type of delirium caused by alcohol ad uh, addiction, and then the bottom part is to be applied to the throat. So, it could be an alcohol-based hallucinogen that's oral? Orally administered? Yeah. An yeah, orally... it seems about the uh, most logical thing to me. An orally administered delirium. What's this red... What's this green shit? Oops. <laughs> ah! Back on the shelf. Thank God we aren't playing Skyrim. Telekinesis, are you? Hey, I only recently discovered it is telekinesis. Ah, <laughs> it's some sort of acid. Wow, that was. I gotta stop putting my non-existent <gasps> hand into things. Fire that's not hot. fire. That's acid. There's a difference. Acid hot. Acid burns. It's not hot. Yeah, whatever. Close enough. No, it's, no, 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 back up, Mementos. It's a barrel full with acid in the kitchen. Why is there a barrel full of acid in the kitchen? Do you have that bottle that you had earlier that you destroyed with um, explosive uh, liquids? What? Uh, we put the primary and the secondary ingredients into the barrel and we, or into the jar and the the chemistry pot, and then we put the chemistry pot on the floor and threw a rock at it and blew it up. No. Do you we... still have that pot? No. It got blown up. Why don't you have that pot? It got blown up! I don't care. Well, fuck you, then. Also, it's a chemistry pot. Do you really think it would react with the acid? I'm not thinking it would react with the acid. I'm thinking it would carry the acid. Well, we can't carry the acid unless I were to stick something else in it. How about this? What about the uh, delirium pot? Uh... Huh? It's kind of a cork in the way. And then there's that. <laughs> Apparently it just dissolved that bottle. That's impressive considering that bottle's of made of glass. I wonder what it would do to a loaf of bread. That's actually amazing. That's glass. Acid should not react with glass. Well, it might not have actually dissolved it. You might have just dropped it into the vat far enough that it vanished. Well, then if it's hollow and full of air, it should have risen to the top. It's buoyant. True. Oh, well, that dissolved. That's cool. Let's find something else to dissolve in it. Let's grab an <laughs> apple. Let's grab an apple. Give me an apple. Give me the apple, you son of a bitch. Ah. I think the apples are part of the... Ooh. Also, I'm hearing a bunch of rats. Do you actually see any? No. Maybe it's my non-existent insanity. Oh, there's a rat! Come here, you. You're going in a pot. <laughs> come here. Come here. Come here. Oh, you are a Come devil. on. Come on, you son of a bitch. Fuck you. It's just rats. Cruel son of a bitch. It's just a rat. Don't give me this. It's a living being. All life is sacred. It's a rodent. All life is sacred. You're not fucking... Actually, I don't know what your religious stance is. Well, okay. You actually don't. There's acid in there. Hooray. Which will probably be useful at some point. Yeah, much later. Oh, let's put the toast in there. If I can pick can it up. Can you pick without... up the toast? Ow! No, I can't. You're, go you're going to kill yourself with these fires. No, I am not. I have two things of... Landrum. Landon. 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 Whatever the... Okay, that's just a guy laughing. We haven't heard <laughs> them in a while, actually. <laughs> that's true, actually. We've been hearing a lot of rats. 
Yeah. Moving here all hunt rats. What else? What was that? That's just a random moan, don't worry about it. Oh god, that's not Oh fuck it saw me. Still haven't lost my reflexes, motherfucker. Does the sprint button still work? Oh, it did! How do you think I got up here so fast? I don't know, because I can't tell when you're sprinting or walking. It's uh, you, you can tell. I'll show you after the guy goes away. What if the guy doesn't go away? What if he just stays there? Well, then I'm dead. Also, it goes away eventually. It always does gets bored and wanders off. What if it comes in here, finds all of the rats, and they sits here munching on rats? Well then, it should have bashed through the door by now. And what's to say that it isn't uh, munching on rats just outside the door? Because the rats are in here. With all the food, right. Mm. Mm. Dumbass. Hey! What? That it was a stupid thing to say. That may be true, but you shouldn't be you shouldn't be offensive like that. Yes, I should. What show is this? I, I thought this was the Happy Care Bear show. No, I think Care Bears got canceled a long time ago. Oh. I suppose I should stop getting up on Saturdays to watch it then. I don't think there is such a thing as Saturday morning cartoons anymore. <laughs> I have no idea. I think the Disney Channel took over or something, I don't know. I haven't watched cartoons. I don't even remember what the last cartoon I watched was. Which is <sighs> sad, now that I think about it. <sighs> okay. I think it might be gone. I think it might be gone. There's not a way out on this side, is there? No. I have no idea. Something around the corner, though. Ugh, I hate it when it just loads for a moment. It always makes me think it's trying to spawn something in. <laughs> What's to say it isn't? Fuck you, shut up. Like, I'm not already nervous enough as it is. Like, it doesn't already take me an eternity to get through this fucking game. Oh, I don't know. I mean, we just spent most of an episode in the kitchen. I wouldn't have minded burning out the entire episode in the kitchen considering what we found when we left. Storage. Oh, come on. There's nothing. If there was, if, if we've already dealt with the thing that was outside the kitchen, then we don't have anything else to worry about. You're safe for now. That's bullshit, and you know it. Actually, no. It's an entirely accurate statement. You are safe for now. Ten feet down the corridor, I don't make any promises. Mother flying fucker can show up whenever the hell he wants. Tends to apparently. I, there's no real rhyme or reason to it, and he is looking for me. You don't know he's looking for you. Yes, yes, I do. Oh. A shadow is haunting you. Very first fucking note we ever found. Oh, right, that that thing. <laughs> well, that thing has been showing up every time you've been solving a, pro a puzzle that lets you clear an area. Oh, what it hasn't was that? Been showing That's up not a until puzzle. You're ready to leave. That's not a puzzle. I found a but thing. That wasn't the that wasn't the, the that wasn't the same thing because the, the shadow thingy is the red masses. I'm assuming. The, no, not no. I think it's that motherfucker that's been hunting us down since, uh, frankly, since we got here, actually. But I'm assuming that that is one of a group of things. Um, the gatherers, I think, is what the notes called them. The gatherers could be referred to as a shadow that haunts you. Considering it's Could always be. in the shadows when we see it. Could be, actually. Doesn't walk around with a fucking light source. Why does it need a light source? What if it's got infrared vision? It clearly doesn't, because we can hide in the darkness. Man, infrared vision, I'm pretty sure would have died a long time ago. <laughs> okay, that's actually true. Yeah. <sighs> I I'm assuming you don't want to imagine the uh, things following you having infrared vision. Fuck no, I don't. Actually, why am I why even? Why not? Why am I even going this way? What do we want? What's in storage that I should even care about? Something to carry the acid. 
I really sincerely doubt that. Like, if why... you have acid, what can you do to the things that are following you? Like throwing acid in their face. I wouldn't want to antagonize these things. If you throw acid in their face, I don't think they're going to be caring what you are. I think it's going to just get more pissed off and angry than any actual effect will occur. After all, the game has made Aww. very clearly that you can't fight these things. Notes say you can't fight them. Freaking tutorials said we can't fight them. We're not going to find a weapon. We hide or we die. Okay. But if you stay still for too long and hide for too long, then the shadow thingy will find you and you're dead. That has not been the case because we have stood around for ages. Like right now, for example. It. The note said it at some point. When? I don't remember. One of the notes said that you had to keep moving or else it would find we you and kill you. have all the notes. Do I really need to go back? We'll go back off camera. I'm not going to subject yeah. people to that. No. Well, I guess storage is a location we can go to, so I might as well. Oh god, did you hear something? Yeah, I think I might have. That. Yeah. Something's banging on something up there. Yeah, it's like four times that I've heard it. It's not banging very hard. I don't want to go up there. Why not? Because that indicates life, and life is the thing that hunts us, and I don't like the thing that hunts us. What if life is the thing that's trying to avoid the thing that's hunting you, and it would be a way to avoid it? Why would it be banging against something attracting attention? I never said that it was intelligent life. Don't get me started. The only not intelligent life around here it seems to be you. Oh, that's a you noticed. If the creature came out here, probably went back this way, or it's in that door. I hate this fucking game. Uh, I think I got that based off the fact that you basically made no progress. That's not true. We found a vat of acid, and we learned that it dissolves things, even glass. And that it's hot. It's not hot, it just burns. There's a difference. Acid hot. Acid burns. Acid hot. Acid burns. Its burning is not due to heat. It is due to chemical reactions. It could be both. No, it... It uh, was it bubbling. Wasn't... But it wasn't being heated by anything. It was bubbling. That can also be induced chemical by chemical reactions. Chemical reactions can generate heat. But self-sustained heat? That doesn't make any sense. I also don't know how long it's been like that. Okay, well then what? Are you implying something heated it up and then stopped? I'm actually implying that something got dropped into the vat and caused it to start creating an exothermic reaction which generated the heat and it would have been a fairly short time before we got here. It would have stopped at some point. Grand. <sighs> it didn't go this way. These things clearly don't or, know how to open or close doors. So it went this okay, way. Okay, that's true. And that door won't budge. Fuck you, game. Fuck you, game, in so many different ways. Maybe that's what you need the acid for. Break the padlock. That still means we need to go to storage and get it. That still means we need to deal with the thing that clearly went that way, because there's no other way to go. Which is true. Which is true. But I'm thinking that's going to be something we have to deal with next time. How did Unless you, you know? want to contradict me on that. How did you know? How did I know what? Never mind. I'll, I'll take your outro for it. We'll deal with it next time.